Here's a good question. What do our tonsils do? I have no idea. We're going to find out. You had yours out. I've had mine out. I had mine out late, like do, in my 30s. Do they serve a purpose? When you have a good question, we give it to Matt. He tries to find us a good answer, and we're talking about tonsils. You guys are you know, perfect examples for this because it seems like I didn't know until today you guys had your tonsils out, but just like everybody, it seems like, has had their tonsils out. So uh, what exactly do tonsils do? You know, Maybe in, back in middle school, you remember Shauna in her late 30s. Maybe you get lots of ice cream. But other than that, tonsils do serve an important purpose. So how can we all live so happily and healthily with them. Let's see. Matt Coma, who works for KUTV in the web department, has been tonsilless for the better part of his life. His used to interfere with his breathing. Doctors told me if I got my tonsils out, it would help with that. Matt recalls it was a painful experience. I categorize it as a very sore throat. Years later, fully recovered from the surgery, Matt says he does not miss his tonsils, and why would he? I still, to this day, don't know what they, what they do. What indeed? It's a good question. So the tonsils sit on either side of the back of the throat. I took the question to S.R. Newman, an ear, nose, and throat doctor for Intermountain Medical Center. Tonsils have a, a specific role in the development of your immune system. Newman says tonsils catch bad things that we breathe in or eat. The tonsils then learn from what is caught, using that information to teach your body how to fight infections. They help in basically programming some of the cells as to how they should work. Well, that all sounds pretty important, and it is, Newman says. So then how are so many people able to live perfectly normal lives without their tonsils? Studies uh, suggest that for the first two years of life, they're critical in that role. After that, they play less, a less significant role. And no need to fret over any long-term harm if a doctor tells you you need to have your tonsils out. Newman says there are other things in our bodies that can teach our immune system about infections. The tonsils are merely that first line of defense. Yeah, and people having their tonsils removed, very common. About half a million kids per year have their tonsils out. Thank you very much for the good question. If you have one, you can shoot me an email through KUTV.com. More answers to your good questions next week. That's a good one. It's I didn't a know. As long as you guys had them out after two, you're good to go. I think I did. Yeah. Shauna was 30. That was yeah. a long time ago. It's kind of hard for me to remember now. I'm trying to put it all together. <laughs> remember the ice cream now. <laughs> yes, right. Yeah, that, I do remember there was a lot of good ice cream yeah. that I had. For I like, just remember uh, the pain. <laughs> yes. All right. Thanks, Matt. You bet.